coming to the press conference. Uh, we had a, a cabinet meeting today, and uh, there were four important decisions that were taken by the cabinet. Uh, the first decision was uh, to amend the Meghalaya Fiscal Responsibility and Budget Management Act 2006. Uh, as you are aware that uh, even last year this uh, particular act was amended and uh, this is done because uh, obviously Government of India has allowed different state governments to increase the budget borrowing based on reforms that are taken by specific states on an annual basis. Even last year the uh, reforms that were taken place by the by the state government in different departments allowed us to increase our budget borrowing limits up to 4%. Uh, and this year again, uh, in the, based on the power uh, reforms that we are taking, uh, there will be 0.5% uh, increase in the uh, budget borrowing that is allowed and uh, that annually it has to be amended. So uh, the particular act and through an ordinance is being amended today. Uh, second is the uh, proposal uh, for adaptation of NCERT textbooks uh, based on uh, certain modifications in certain subjects uh, will be done by MBOS uh, from now on and uh, this decision has been taken and by that I mean in the coming uh, academic year the process is going to start and uh, we will see this adaptation taking place as we move forward but immediately uh, the cabinet decision that has been taken today is uh, to allow uh, the adaptation of the NCERT textbooks with necessary modifications uh, from class 1 to class 10 and uh, there are certain uh, schools that are uh, in local language in vernacular language the classes are taught for them, from class 1 to 5, the adaptation or the necessary changes in the, uh, the language will be done. And uh, once the translation and language is done, then the adaptation will take place. Uh, let me just go into the background of why this is important. Uh, this is important because uh, we have a, a concern uh, in the overall education system and after doing thorough research and consultation with different stakeholders at different levels in the education system, uh, we have come to the conclusion that uh, most of the textbooks that are being used in MBOS, especially when it comes to these three standardized subjects, which is science, English and mathematics, the books are not at the standards of the national level. And hence, to improve the overall quality of the textbooks, we are adopting this. That's number one. Uh, also, number two, that uh, in terms of the learning outcomes at the elementary stage, uh, the textbooks that we are using currently are not in conformity <coughs> with that particular aspect. And hence, to bring us in line with the learning outcomes at the national level, we are changing this uh, textbooks. And this changing of the textbooks uh, will also lead to a reduction in the number of textbooks being used at the uh, different class levels. Just to give an example to you that uh, under the MBOS right now for class 1, 2 and 3, there are 11 textbooks that are recommended. Uh, but under NCERT, there are only four textbooks. So hence, the number of textbooks will go down drastically. In fact, for class... Uh, uh, five, uh, if I recall from the presentation, there were 17 textbooks under uh, MBOS, whereas for class for uh, uh, under NCERT, it is below 10. It is about eight, nine something. So therefore, there will be a large reduction in the number of textbooks that uh, will be used. Uh, there will be increase uh, and improvement in the quality of the content that will be uh, imparted to the students. It will be in conformity to a large number of requirements at the national level, including the learning outcomes. And hence, this process is being done. And this also is being done in a larger scale, uh, keeping in mind the state uh, curriculum uh, SGF, they call it. Uh, so that particular SGF, state curriculum also, 
the amendments to those or rather the uh, drafting of those aspects will also be taken up and we will ensure that the curriculum also is uh, adapted to the national curriculum and with of course necessary adaptation uh, to local contents because we are very very clear as a cabinet that uh, the subjects in which we require local knowledge, local content based on our culture, based on our history and based on our uniqueness, all these aspects should not be diluted and hence the subjects where these matters are the subjects are there, uh, we will take necessary steps to adapt the NCT, NCERT content and come out with our own textbooks, but the content will be based on the NCERT norms and standards.